it started as a joke. When I retired finally from the public service in February 2009, I went home and I thought my usefulness, relevance in this world had come to an end. So I wanted to take it easy, relax, sleep, and do nothing. Now, little did I remember that earlier in our life, when we were in the diplomatic service, that's when she started writing her book, The Journey Within, we were in the Netherlands. I had just opened the mission in the Netherlands, uh, with all the challenges, logistics. Then she started writing, because I had an old typewriter, which I used to carry everywhere. And I never used it. She actually started using it herself. So she started writing a few paragraphs. I got home one day and saw what she had written. She was very excited that particular day. Showed me what she had written and said, yeah, you are a good writer. Continue, we'll support you. My children were still very young, but they understood well enough what the mother was doing. At this point, before I continue, maybe I want to introduce you to my children. Are they around so that you can see them? Stand up if you're here. If you're here. And there, is, uh, there is Felix, I think he's the one in the shots. <laughs> he's our firstborn. And there is Fidel, our second born. The, do uh, the daughter, the last born, apparently is stuck in traffic. That's what. <laughs> yeah, you can sit down. So, we encouraged her to write. And we pushed her to write. She never forgot. So, when I retired, I wanted to relax. She said, No, wake up and do something. I said, but I'll finish my work. What am I supposed to do? Go and write something. So the first week was OK. I was on honeymoon that time. The second week, she woke up, went and made breakfast, came and said, you have to start writing. <laughs> and she even did greater things. Just tore the blanket off me. <laughs> I resisted. Second day she did the same thing. Third day I gave in. So I was waking up early to go and write. But I didn't know what to write. 